In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and set up Universal Updater, allowing you to download homebrew apps directly on your 3DS. No need to take your SD card out when you're downloading from here. So let's get started. Go to the description and click on the link that will take you to this GitHub page for Universal Updater. It'll be the latest release and it's created by Epic Pikmin 11. Now if you scroll down, you can see this QR code that you can use to download straight on your 3DS if you please, but I'm going to be doing it through uh, my SD card on the computer. So right here, it says universalupdater.cia. This is the one we want, so just click on it and it should download in the bottom left. And once that's downloaded, you can pull up your 3DS SD card. Here's what mine looks like. And then once you have it up, go into your CIAS folder and just drag the download into there. So it should just look like this. And that's all we need to do here. So uh, let's eject our SD card and I'll meet you on my 3DS. Now, once you're on your 3DS, go to your FBI software, load it up. If you don't have this, uh, we installed it in my initial homebrew video, so if you want to know how, you can go check that out. But once you're here, just click A on SD, scroll down to CIAS, press A, and you should see Universal Updater. So just scroll down, select A on it, and go to Install and Delete CIA. This will install it and then get rid of the file off your SD card so it's not taking up any unnecessary space. So just click A and then click A again and it should download the file. Once it's done, just press OK and it should be empty. So press B, B, and then the Home button. You can close that software. And then we should see the universal updater, just like that. So let's open it and uh, see what it's all about. The initial startup might take longer than uh, any time you open it afterwards. And you do need your 3DS to connect to the internet in order to install these. It's just what's new, you can scroll down, just press A to skip that. And then here we go, this is the uh, universal updater homebrew store. So as you can see, you can just scroll through. You have different games you can play, like Nazi Zombies. Uh, you have emulators, MGBA, Atari, Third Tube. You have retro arts that you can download. Different games like Flappy Bird. And then if you wanna search, you can uh, just click the search icon and type in whatever you wanna find. So uh, just like that, we have all the different options for FBI. And I'll just show you how to download it quick. So find the one you want, press A on it. You can do 3DSX or CIA, so let's just do the CIA, press confirm, and if you go to the circle there, you can see the download in action, and it's not too big, so it seems to be, that was very quick. But now we can go to the home screen, new software, press OK, let's find it. There we go. You can download homebrew apps and games directly from your 3DS. Oh. <laughs> but anyways, that is how you download homebrew apps and games directly on your 3DS. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like and uh, comment if you ran into any issues. You can also join my Discord server if you want to get some help there. But anyways, that's it for the video and I will see you on the next one. Subscribe for more 3DS videos in the future. Bye.